switch on the pen and press the button nearest the nib until you hear the sound. You probably haven't used your pen friend in the blue light mode yet. And what it does is it opens up your pen friend to a wide range of books. This video will show you how your pen friend can be used with our tactile talking books. Here we have four well-known folk tales, the famous musicians of Bremen, and the Billy Goat's Gruff, all with large print, or Goldilocks. Can you see the shiny lacquer lines around the bears? You might want to stop the video to look carefully. They're raised for you to feel, so are a very important part of the storytelling experience. Let's take a closer look at the Indian folktale, Bury and the Marrow. Remember to take the pen, switch it to blue light mode. At the corner of every page, to help guide a blind or partially sighted person, and there's the a sound spot within a tactile layer that you can feel. So, whenever you touch the corner with your pen friend, the pen will read out the text. This is a common rule in every book. Just touch the top, outside corners of the page to hear the story. Also, every character has a tactile outline. Remember in Goldilocks you saw the bears? And when you touch the character, you hear them talk or make their sounds. This adds some more fun. So just to recap, touch the top outside corners to hear the story. Touch the characters to hear additional audio. So it becomes an interactive, exploratory experience. So let's see what we have here. All the food has the lacquer outline. You can't really see it on the video, but I can feel it. So when I touch it... There you go. It adds that extra aid to help visualize the page. Give it some extra magic. Now, because these books are made for the partially sighted or fully blind child, a parent or sighted person can add extra descriptions to the pages themselves. Tell the child exactly what you see so they can revisit the book and know what the page contains. It adds a personal touch to the experience. Here's an example. Page 3 and 4. Page 3 is on the left-hand side. It's a scene, like a map. It shows Bury's house on the left edge and her daughter's house on the right edge. For Bury to get there, she travels down a winding path through green forest, past some funny-looking houses belonging to a magical world. Keep following the path with your finger along the lacquer line, all the way to her daughter's house. Following the path with your finger along the lacquer line, all the way to her daughter's house. These tactile talking books, designed for use with your pen friend, add a new sharing experience between parents and children with sight impairments. They are great award-winning books and they are the first in our library, and first in the world, to be used with your pen friend.